environment here is something that is very unique. You have people here that are interested in many different things and are motivated to get things done. So it kind of rubs off on you. That motivation, whether they have the same interests as you or not, you're gonna get motivated to do whatever you wanna pursue. Students are able to really sit down and focus on who they are and, and ask that question, who am I and where am I going and how am I getting there? Our goal is really to help students get connected to their passion. Uh, Tide introduced me to Foothill College, which is uh, the college, community college that I've been using to take my extracurricular activities. Um, there's this one class that I took, it was uh, entrepreneurship and engineering. And uh, by taking these classes, I can see that this is something that I'm really interested in. and. Um, something that I want to do after I graduate from high school. Um, the dual enrollment at Foothill and Coastline that I've had since freshman year has been really helpful into getting the experience that I'm going to need in the future. Your dual enrollment courses here that you get offered here at Tide Academy, whether you decide to go with coding or business, um, most of those are actually asynchronous, meaning you get the assignments and they're due per se Friday and you get the Monday. So it builds up a lot of character on being independent. You're actually given liberty, which in a way obviously builds your character to, to basically know if you're gonna be able to turn in the assignment or not and just be, be on top of things. So one thing that we have here at Tide is project-based learning. Project-based learning is when we do a project instead of doing like a memorization test or like just doing more projects rather than tests and quizzes where we just have to like, you know, memorize information and it's better because we actually, I feel like I learn more through that way. In today's world, you know, knowledge is as far as a Google search, really. But the skills of creative thinking and problem solving and collaboration are the skills that are really needed to survive academically and career-wise. I think it's been, uh, you know, really hands-on learning because that's like the one reason that I joined the school because it's a STEM school. It's like based around like science, technology. It's very, you know, immersive and we get to like do things with the teacher. I have a lot of support, like with students and staff at this school, where like I can succeed in the class and learn a lot. Since we're a small school, we are able to anticipate students' needs because we know them better. I've had a handful of students since they were freshmen. I had them last year, I have them now as juniors and we're able to develop deeper relationships with one another that really helps me support them. And every teacher here, I can definitely say that all of them enjoy teaching and are super enthusiastic about what they do. You also get to know them a little bit more on a personal level, which obviously makes the class a little bit more enjoyable. We have a lot of spirit at the school. We have a big heart. Your opinions and voice are like always heard and they're addressed by the admin and the student council. We are able to pretty much, since it is such a small school, just add a sport or add a club if we get a certain amount of people, which is really nice. It's a place where you're able to find a lot of diversity and a lot of different clubs, so you'll definitely feel welcome no matter what club you choose to go into, just because there's just a big diversity into, into any club that you want to do. It's easier to make um, friends and it's easier to like stay in those friend groups. Um, I say this because I had that experience myself. Um, I came in not knowing anybody. Now I have a large friend group, so um, I pretty much know almost everybody at the school. It feels good to be able to know people and have good connections with people because, I mean, you don't want to be at a school where you don't know anybody or be at a school where you don't feel like you can talk to anyone. I feel like here you can start a conversation with anyone in the hallways and they'll be genuine to continue the conversation with you. So it feels really good. It feels like you're accepted. It feels like home. It feels like a second home to me here at Tide.